Hi everyone, welcome back to Outdoor Adventure Craft. I'm really excited to be back with you guys after a couple weeks. It's uh, hunting season here in New Brunswick now. I'm going to be out looking for squirrel and partridge this evening. Also rabbit if I come across it. I'm also excited to tell you guys that it's time for the 1000 subscriber giveaway. I got a couple of free t-shirts for you guys and I'm really excited to tell you more about it. So uh, let's get going and see what we can find before the sun goes down on us. take her pretty slow through here. I actually got a partridge here earlier this week. It's all apple trees right here. Same with the squirrels, they come in, pick at these apple trees. Quite a dense spruce and fir area here. So I'm going to creep in. Looks like a good area for some squirrels. Up in the trees. Kind of moving into a more open area of hardwoods. Hey guys, so far we got uh, nothing yet. Sometimes just stopping and chilling out for a bit. We'll get the squirrels chattering at you and stuff. But uh, before I run out of daylight today, I wanted to uh, tell you guys about the 1000 subscriber giveaway. You guys have heard me express my thanks before for your support. Uh, it's kept me going. It's, uh, it's turned this into something, you know, worth doing. It, it's been a lot of fun for me and uh, I passed 1,000 subscribers there about two weeks or so ago and I've got a couple of t-shirts for you guys. I'll show them to you in a minute. I'm going to sit down here in a bit and get a drink but uh, all you got to do is be a subscriber here at Outdoor Adventure Craft and uh, like the video, thumbs up and comment down below that you want to be entered in the draw and that's it and I'll randomly select. I've got two a white one and a black one outdoor adventure craft t-shirt and I'll send those out to you guys so uh, let's look for a little spot to sit down have a little break and I'll tell you more if you can see right in the center of the frame there's a bull moose looking straight at me while I was talking to you guys two seconds ago he was there I'm just going to stand very still for a minute. I could send off a warning shot, but I think I'll just wait here as long as my nerves hold up and then I'm just going to back off. There he goes. So this is pretty awesome, except for now he's between on the other side of those trees. I like the fact that he's faced away from me. 
Okay, so that was pretty crazy. Had I not stopped to talk to you guys right when I did, I'd have basically walked right on to him. He, uh, he was sitting right on this little footpath here. And he, I stood there for a while, filmed him, talked to you guys, and then he got up, looked at me for a bit, <coughs> and then started up farther off the trail. Where we saw him is only about 100 feet from here, but he's already pushed up quite a ways. I watched him at a site there, so. Yeah, so that was uh, exhilarating. A little bit more than I bargained for, I guess. I, I was looking for squirrel, right? <laughs> you know, the moose the size of a horse. So that was pretty interesting. I, uh, I'm going to work my way back down a little bit before I sit down and relax, just in case he comes back to see what I'm doing. All right, guys, catch up with you in a bit. Hey guys. Yeah, so that was kind of neat. Still haven't seen anything. But another hour of daylight. This is where it actually really gets good. So I'll show you that t shirt. You guys might have seen it in other videos before. Getting pretty warm anyway, tromping through the woods. So yeah, to celebrate Outdoor Adventure Craft and 1,000 subscribers, I've got two Outdoor Adventure Craft t-shirts. One just like this in black and a white one. Uh, both are extra large, so hopefully you can use them or have a friend that can use them. And again, I want to say thank you very much, guys, for your support. It's been a lot of fun uh, starting this channel. You know, we've been doing uh, campouts and bushcraft and survival situations and bag loadouts and gear reviews and stuff like that. So it's been a lot of fun for me. It's been nice to get to know people in the community. So hopefully you guys enjoy uh, the channel so far and, and what's to come. I missed. There was two partridge sitting right in the limbs of this tree right here. One flushed and I heard him but didn't get a shot and I didn't even realize there was another one sitting right beside it. And then I did see him at the last second and he started to fly and I got a shot off but I missed. But they both went that way and that's the way my truck is so let's head through there and see if we can flush them out again. Just heard the squirrel over there. First one I heard call all day. What do we do? Do we head for the squirrel I just heard or keep looking for the partridge? It's getting late. We need to start moving that way. We'll get that squirrel some other day. Maybe we'll come on those partridge. Well, them partridge are giving me the run around in that bush. I got a shot off, missed him. He was sitting there, I couldn't see him, he flew back again. It's just too tight 
and they are too camouflage. But uh, I'm running low on battery, so I should say goodbye. Truck's just back here a ways. So unless something happens in the next little bit, we'll catch you next time. Don't forget about the 1,000 subscriber giveaway. Subscribe here at Outdoor Adventure Craft. Thumbs up the video. Comment. Get involved. Check out my website, www.outdooradventurecraft.com. I write up articles on all my little videos and stuff like that. But like I said, unless we see something in the next couple of minutes, it's been nice being with you guys today. Pretty exciting to see that moose there, and, and we'll see you next time.